What's up, you guys? Y'all, it is so cold. And look how, look at, look at this cute little, um, like, throw over thing that my husband bought me. I don't know what it is. It's not a coat. It's not a sweater, but, um, he ordered it off Shein, too. But it's like a little throw on, like, it's no button or nothing. You just throw it on. Hoodies, you can take the hoodie off and on. But I'm gonna leave the hoodie on. So right now I'm just sitting here waiting for the kids to get out of school. I went and stopped and got me some Takis. <laughs> I just had a taste for something hot, so I got some Takis. I got this, and then they have my, the camera is dying. But they got that, they had that in the bag, and then like some little crisps. I love these things, like, Every so often, not like to eat all the time. Just every so often, I got that just to snack on for something spicy. And I'm also addicted to the um, not the um, not jalapenos, the pepperonchi. If you ever went to um, Olive Garden, that little green pepper that they put inside the salad, that. Or sometimes like when you order from like Papa John's Pizza, some pizzeria shops, they put the pepperoncis on the side with like the garlic dip or something. I Me, mean, I like I'm like I'm like so addicted to that lately. But um other than that, what's happening? I gotta keep like a uh, lip balm or something in the car because for some reason in the winter, as soon as you get in the car, you like, you just feel like you gotta put something on your lips. Like all the time. Pay attention to that, like see, like even if you get in a car, you got on makeup already, you got your lipstick, and when you get in a car, you just feel like, you be like, <laughs> I don't know what that is. I don't know what that means. But yeah, it's cold. It was snowing this morning. Um, I'm just in here waiting for the for the kids to get out of school. Keep turning the heat off and on. <laughs> but what y'all up to? What are y'all up to? Yo, it's crazy because at work we've been talking about um, the Generation Z and the Millennials. I am a Millennial baby. But the comparison, like, is so funny like i'll give you guys one example that i went review with my students generation z have more um they can multitask better than um the millennials so for example like if i go out to eat with somebody and then somebody like text my phone i'll go oh hold on one second and then you know respond or whatever but the generation z they could talk and then just be texting and talking and like, first of all, that's rude. <laughs> but that is a difference. Um, it was a few. They have more patience. No, we have more patience. They don't tolerate nothing. Like, they have zero tolerance. Like, pay attention to your family members or if you are a Gen Z. When you're Gen Z, that means you were born between... Okay, so clearly the camera died and um, obviously it's the next day. But uh, I wanted to finish what I was telling you about the millennials and the um, Gen Z generation. So the Gen Z is born between 1995 to, um, to 2000s. And millennials are 1980 to 1995, so I would be considered a millennial. Um, let me know what you guys would be considered. Like, what year were you born? Um, what year were you born in? And um, so, like I was saying, what I was talking to my students about. Um, 
like the examples they have less patience than we do like I was saying we will stay at a job or in a relationship or anywhere stressful longer than they would the minute they feel stressed out they're not dealing with that crap and they're gonna tell you about it <laughs> so I know I know for for me that that is kind of true but I am learning that I'm starting not to have that patience like with people the minute I feel annoyed or stressed out, I don't want to be bothered. Like, like you're done. Like, that's it. Like, we have nothing to talk about. And another thing, my cutoff game is strong. So, like, once I don't fuck with you, like, there's no doubling back. Especially, like, relationships. Like, especially friendships. Barely it has happened, but it hasn't stuck. So, yeah, I don't, I don't really care to be, like, doubling back. Um, oh, the front is out here, but I'm about to. Um, oh, you guys can't even see me, but the sun is out here, so bad. I'm about to go to the grocery store, so the sun is so bad. So, I'm gonna um, catch y'all back in a minute. Like I said, it's no pain, so I will um, keep you updated with like the results of it. this vlog is like literally all over the place but right now I am getting ready to head to AC for hubby's birthday and um yeah we're about to get on the road I think this trip is about an hour and 20 minutes from here so we're about to do that and I'm gonna take you guys with me show you the room everything and look at me I'm a little raisin or whatever thank you but yes, I'm gonna take you with me. Um, it's cold. This this weekend is supposed to be really cold. So um, yeah, so let's see what it's hitting for. waiting for our room to be done this is the like waiting area and we are staying at oceans casino resort so yeah like I said we're just waiting for our room to be done um, we're pretty much we're checked in already and um, I'm gonna show you the room nice ocean view they got the little fire pit thingy going on here look you can see it see it we might go sit out there but all right check you in a minute here's the room we are on the eighth floor this is the view 
we got a Ocean View Studio Suite. And so this is the living room area, that's the view. Bedroom area, refrigerator here. This is the refrigerator, but they don't stock anything. Two nightstands. Um, what is this? Closet. Yeah, so the closet has iron board, iron hangers. Down to the bathroom. The bathroom is really cute. Separate shower. And it has the rainfall shower head. little door for the toilet two sinks and the mirror <laughs> so let us unpack and then I'll see you later so we're about to go get something to eat I think we're gonna head to sugar factory um and probably like later on some water or something I don't know, but I'm trying to figure out where are the um, lounges that inside of here because I didn't even know they had that in here. So we gotta look for all of that. But right now we're about to get some food because I'm starving. You put your hat on again. Are you recording me? Say hi. What's going on, y'all? Birthday weekend out here. Just relaxing, huh? Chilling. Like he, oh, he turned in fucking 40. I heard that. That's crazy. That's disrespectful. <laughs> Birthday boy. Another club. <laughs> <laughs> Who you want to give a shout out to? <laughs> Shout out to the kids, man. <laughs> yeah. To me and to Mel, what's going on? <laughs> 32 is a good gift. What's this restaurant here? Um, Hoppers. Hoppers. <laughs> yeah. There are lobbies over there. <laughs> oh, not the thing, bro. For me? Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Okay, what am I getting? Let's see. So, I got quesadilla and some lava lava shrimp they said this is like thai chili sauce i'm on a diet i got a little bit of food it's actually a lot look how big that burger is sorry it ain't like we to make it one man mo all right so i'm gonna eat guys
French toast, bacon, scrambled eggs with cheese, and some potatoes. And happy birthday.